As you saw Matt wearing a mask there, it is now mandatory to wear one or a cloth covering inside Pennsylvania businesses. We were at the Acme in Northern Liberties moments after the governor's order took effect at 8 o'clock tonight. An employee was at the door making sure people had their faces covered. The order does not apply to health care providers or those medically unable to wear one. Here's how it will be enforced. If someone comes to a, uh, a store and is not wearing a mask, then they're most likely be asked to go home and to get a mask. It, it is possible that over time that that might stiffen, but that's most likely what's going to happen. Will there be penalties if any businesses don't abide by the order? I, I think that we'll see. Well, Eyewitness News reporter Crystal Cranmore picks up the story. A store could deny entry to customers who do not comply unless the business is providing food or medication. Having to sort of police that to get in the middle of a customer and entering the store, mm -hmm. that's a concern. I think that if a store is regularly not uh, not following that, then um, uh, local officials might give a warning and we'll see if there are continued problems with that. The president of the Pennsylvania Food Merchants Association says he's also worried about the state now mandating businesses supply their employees with masks. A lot of the PPE equipment is in very short supply. Our members are really working around the clock to try and uh, you know, follow through uh, with the directive as best they can. Under the order, employees must wear the face coverings at all times except to eat or drink. The majority of the businesses that I've noticed are all adhering to that already. Philadelphia South 9th Street Business Association says its members are prepared to continue fighting the spread of the virus. The more we can do to protect ourselves, the better. Crystal Cranmore, CBS3 Eyewitness News.